this is the high rise elevator lever. And I am filming the Golden Princess cruise ship currently docked in Juneau, Alaska. And let's start with the cabin tour. This is my stateroom C211 or 10211. It's an inside cabin. It's not much here. There's my bed. My keyboard is on my bed. Dad's bed. There's the phones. My suitcase. Here's a mirror. And the closet space here. Now, on a cruise ship, here's the cruise ship style bathroom. Open that up. Turn on the light. Fluorescence. Alright, come on. This is a cruise ship bathroom. Got our cups and bottles over there. There's the cruise ship toilet, which is closed. And listen to this. Cruise ship toilet has a weird flush. Well, all in all, everything's pretty small because we are on a ship. I'm going to close this up and go do an in-depth tour, in a way, of the rest of the ship. Here's my cabin. Let's go to the forward elevators. I'm in the forward hallway. Heading to the forward elevators. I'll be monitoring time on this video and it will be broken up into clips. I'm sorry for in advance. I'm only filming in 720 right now because if I were to film in 1080, I only have 20 minutes, and I want this to be longer than 20 minutes. This is a cruise ship. It's about half a mile long. Just walking from one end to the other. That's a good five minutes. This is just walking to the forward elevator, so I haven't even gone aft. Here we are, the forward elevators on the Golden Princess. And since all marine elevators are Schindler and Kone, these are Schindler, but cool Schindlers. Schindler touch sensitive. And let's go up. Now it's lit. All I have to do is touch it. And I will wait for, there it is, one of four elevators. This is the last one. Yes. All right, we'll go to deck 15, right there. Sorry if I hit anything else. But the door closes very slow. Here we go. Aloha, deck 12. Didn't mean to hit 12, but these are touch sensitive, so if I just touch it by accident, it lights up. Here's deck 15, coming up. I'm going to go to deck four. Now I, I touched four. Instant door closed, listen. Door closed button works in these elevators. Even though they're only 13 years old. We are going to go down to, why didn't it light up? Deck four. There we go. Let me get a cab view of this elevator. Most of the elevators are the same, except for the glass ones, which will be the ones I film at midship. Only difference between those and the normal ones, the normal ones go to four, the glass ones don't. But at the same time, I'm going to film those. Alrighty. We are coming down to deck four. Non-stop. Now, close the door. I'm going up to deck 7 promenade so I can show you the outside of the ship, the bow, and the vantail. Promenade, deck 7. Here we go.
Alright, now you're exiting on the starboard side of the bow area. Now, you're going to go for a little walk out on the deck. This way. is the door to the deck and it is ripped off great and it's probably because we're in port so on this deck there are the casinos and the promenade shops I'll try to show that at midship I'm gonna try the other side just in case but not good news. They put the gangland deck six, so it really makes it tough to get around the decks now. We're in port. I may have to do another clip and route to see and can actually get out. Probably later tonight. Let's see if they lock off the whole deck. The Princess Theater is up here. I'm not gonna show every room, but I'm gonna basically say what's up to those princess theaters on deck seven the casino some of the rooms i'm not going into just because i don't have to deal with the hassle of walking through especially the casino all right let's see any ropes on this Ooh, the starboard side was ripped off but not the port side where the gangway is yeah we're outside on the bow now ah my walking around paid off Good. Well, now, gotta be very careful because I'm on the deck of a cruise ship. I'm gonna hold my phone more securely like this and my fingers to make it in the video. But safety is my number one concern right now. Alright, I'll go. That's a view over the side. We are on the Golden Princess docked in Juneau, Alaska. Our first port of call. Monday, July 28th, 2014. I'm not going to go up the stairs to the bow, but you see this is the exit for the theater here. And up that way is the staircase that goes up, and there's another one that goes up to the bow. I am going to, however, walk to the fantail and go into the aft elevators. There's some interesting stuff back here. I might go into just if I if I pause, I'm gonna let you know that it's a pause, and I'll try to start back in the same place if time permits. But if I'm running out of storage on my phone, then I will try to warn you, impending termination of the video. It may terminate without a warning. Just let you know. Let's take a stroll down deck seven, which is the main deck, the promenade deck in port in Seattle. This is where the main gangway is. Amidships, actually that's aft. The main gangway in Seattle comes onto this at aft. We are heading aft right now on the port side. Sorry again for filming this in 720. I know it looks much better to you sighted people in 1080, but I honestly did not have the space and I couldn't make more space but like 50 apps and I could just delete them all. That traffic is, you're approaching midships and what you're hearing probably the sound of people walking on and off the ship via the main gangway which is now located on deck six midship we are not going to go there it is going to be way too crowded people coming on and off the ship and the security checkpoint do not want to get involved with that i already did been off and on seaplane as a matter of fact we are heading aft to the fan tail where you can get a view over the rear of this Ship, the Golden Princess. So we're heading all the way aft on deck seven. And I must warn you, the starboard side. No, I'll tell you, the port side doors coming back in. 
are harder to navigate than the starboard. So I'm going to go around the fence on the starboard before I re-enter the ship. And we will be in the back when that does happen. I'm also going to do a storage check here. So while I'm at the fan tail, I'm going to check how much storage I have used. I started at 5.0 gigabytes. I want to track how this clip is going and how, how much data I have used storing on this clip. How much I have left. Here. See, this is what I said about cruise ships being half a mile long and needing more space. I've been walking for like four minutes now, five. Still haven't made it to the back of the ship. These things are huge and fun. Now I'm going to try to sneak into the nightclub. And if there's not crew there, that'd be great. If there is, then I'll just have to deal with it. But um, maybe some other time, like maybe a day at sea. I try to sneak in there when there, when there aren't people. If there aren't people, then that means I can do what I want in there. Just main, mainly show show you what the nightclub is and how cool everything is on board the ship. All right, this narrow part means that we are in fact at the fan tail. Just another few more feet through this area, and we will be at the complete rear end of the ship, all the way as far back as you can go, except for the nightclub. And pretty interesting spot on the ship. So this echoey area is right before the fan tail. We are reaching the fan tail now. Here we are. The stern of the ship. Aftmost section. And I will give you a view off the ship. See so here's the fan tail. And there's a view over the water in Juneau. There's the port of Juneau, the city of Juneau, capital of Alaska. Now, for now, I'm going to be stopping and doing a video check. I'll be back with you shortly. All right, you guys, I am back, and I will have to cut this short at some point because I do not have much data. I'm only 1.8 gigs. I've already used 0.9 gigs in this 1245 that I've done so far. So, I'll be heading back in. We'll do the mat. We'll be doing the aft elevators, and then I'll start cutting segments. I really do want to show you the nightclub though, if I can get in, so that's gonna be top of my list. And then the leader deck will be next, and the midship elevators, and that should do it for the most part for this tour. See what the starboard side's blocked. I'm not going that way. Whoops. They are working there, so I'm going to have to go in the port side, just deal with it. Let me get my more secure grip here. It's not cutting to the port side. Access. I'm gonna go ahead. Alright, 
These are locked. I'm gonna cut the video until I get to an unlocked door. All right, folks, I have found the door that's unlocked. I got past all the stuff to the starboard side door. You're going in on the aft of the ship. Okay. I'm just gonna go. There, I'm inside. I'm sorry about that. I did technically. I've. There. Technically. Technically, I've violated some regulation there by going under the ropes. You're not supposed to do that, but who cares? They're doing work on the starboard side of the ship. They didn't want me going that way. They should have unlocked the port side. That's all I have to say. Now, let me get the elevator down here. The in middle two, I don't want the N2. I want the N2 run on a special controller. Whichever one comes first, I'm, getting, I'm gonna get. I'm gonna cut the weight out. Alrighty. Let's go down to six. I got the elevator now. These are the aft elevators on board. The Golden Princess. Let's go up to Sky Deck 17 and 18. There we go. Let's see here. That means there's probably crew up there. We may get turned around. It's almost four o'clock. But might as well try this the moving sidewalk they have. And if I can't get in here, I'll get in on another video. I'll find a way. Somehow, here's the big sidewalk. I'm gonna show you on. There's the windows on the bridge going up. It's probably gonna be clean in it. There are people in there. I'm gonna have to come back at like one o'clock on Wednesday when we're at sea and see if I can try my luck. All right, I am going to cut out until we get to the midship elevators and the Lido deck. Well, until then. There are midship elevators in the glass elevators that I said I would film. We're gonna take a trip on these. Oh, this one's to the right. Let's go with touch 14. So you just touch it and it goes. Now let's take a look out the back. Probably gonna stop again because I hit the down button too. I touch five. Now watch. I touch door close now. The doors close. Now I'm gonna take a look out the back as we descend below the leader deck and 
come down towards the atrium, you get a view on the Golden Princess glass elevators, starboard elevator of the glass signals. Ah, we passed deck 10. The other one must have gotten my down call. Uh, there's the atrium. You see, you see the light coming from the atrium, or at least I can tell. And here's deck 5. Now I'm going to go 14 again. You see, I touch 14 now. I just touch or close. And we're gone. And we'll take a look up the atrium. And we're going to get out on deck 14. Which I need to touch again. Hold on. See, there's 14. Yeah. Alright, so now we're up in the atrium, we're gonna go up through the top. We just did, I think. We're going up through the decks, up above the atrium. And we're gonna come out on Mito. Or this, oh, not the sunlight, but just the light's gonna come in. From Lido. And here we are. And it lights up the cab for a cab view. I'm going to exit these elevators. I'm going to do a little quick look around the Lido deck. Try not to consume more time than I need. I'm also going to do a data check here before I continue on to the last part of the video. This part here. See you back here. This is the indoor pool area on the Lido deck. This is the enclosed roof area. And I'm going to do a data check. I'll be back. My frugal data settings are good. I've got like one gig left, which is a good bit of time at 720. About 12 minutes. So without further ado, I will show you the main Lido deck. Go out the front. I won't do the Horizon restaurant until I do the nightclub. I'm going to film that, then I'll film Horizon here right now. I'm just filming the main Lido deck. Let's walk out and enjoy the Lido deck. Here we are. This deck has hot tubs and pools. And around here is one of my favorites. I'll show you my two favorite places on the Lido deck. This is all food, of course. The ice cream is right down here. There's the ice cream parlor. And there's the rear of the ship. There are tables. I'll show Horizon on the other video. I actually will. Alright. I might, might do a little bit of lounge stuff. Now, here, it's a nice set of Lido deck. We're going to go into the port side of the front. And I'll show you the pizza parlor. We head forward back towards my cab. Hello. Hi. Hello. Doing fine. Hello. Excuse me. It's the other side. Other side. Yeah. Just trying to head forward. Out of ooh, the rain. I want to stay under. No, I'm staying under the awning. Uh, there we go. That's much better. Get me on the port side. Under the awning. Uh, I've got it. There. Hi, Where okay. are you on the go? I'm just heading up. I'm just walking up the deck. Passing the pizza place on the right and heading forward to the door. Which here. Right here. Forward side door. 
and this will safely bring me onto the Lido deck. I'll open the inner door here, and I'll be on my way to the forward elevators in no time. I'm going to end on my deck with a little demonstration of one of the things I know how to do. Here we go. Let's get on the forward elevator and head to my deck. I say end, but I'm really ending this part, and then I'll do the other portions as time permits, including lounges and a few things, just short clips of each location. Except for the nightclub, because that's really cool, and I want to give it justice. I'm going to edit out the elevator waiting, and I'll be back when the elevator comes. There's an elevator right here. Going up. Actually, it didn't wait very long at all. Deck 15. After a quick demonstration. Here we are. Now all the forward phones are the extension 300. This is 10 300 is the extension. Now below us is deck 9. I am going to call the phone. I'm deck nine in the forward elevators. See this is the phone here? Watch. Nine, three, zero. Listen. Zero. And I thought I should just show you that. And I'll take one more view here. And for now, that's it. But I'll be back. Okay, I am back. As you can see, the moving sidewalk is not moving. Which is a good sign that there might not be anyone up here. So I can take a look around. That's it. Let's go see. This is the lounge area. Tables and windows and seats everywhere. Your people. There's someone doing something. There's just stairs right there. There's just stairs. This is cool. It's the elevator at the Skywalker's Lounge going up. Let's go. And that ramp will close up. And we're moving. To the top. and a view out the top area. It's actually a pretty nice place to go to. There are seats, as you can see, there's tables, and there are windows. It's pretty peaceful right now, but this is the ship's nightclub. Not really supposed to be in here. I'm going to head back down. You see, these are the controls up, down, and stop. This is a hydraulic. I get back on and head down. And you 
can watch the gate as I hit down. And there we go. The gate's locked. You can watch it as I go down. Here at the Skywalker's nightclub. There's the ramp at the bottom. That will open up when we get to the ground. There we go. Now I'm going to head out of here and get an elevator to go to down to 14. And if I have any time left, I'll show you Horizon's Lounge. Which is where you eat. So there's the moving sidewalk. It's stationary. And I'm heading across the bridge down to deck 17. There. I'm going to do one last data check. And I'm going to hop on these elevators. Take a trip down to 14. I did not say earlier, but I am in Skagway today. We are in the port of Skagway in Alaska. Let us go down to deck. Fourteen. See, don't shoot the lights up. Heading to get a little quick view of Horizons and in the tour with a port side view of Skagway. Here we go. Here we go. Deck 14. Welcome to Skagway. I'm gonna head out this way. The lounge. I won't be able to show the pools, but I'll show this. There's a view. I come in here. There's the windows looking out over Skagway. That's it.